What's up, people? This is Afro Joe again. Doing this second video I did. Y'all, you see the Kim Kardashian video, and I'm doing the second one on Justin Bieber. Now, y'all heard the news that this 20 year old girl is coming out and saying that Justin Bieber is the father of her three month old baby. And a lot of people calling bullshit on it. I'm not calling bullshit on it. I'm not. I can't say, oh, it's bullshit. A lot of people say, oh, you're bullshitting, you're bullshitting. Oh, it's fake, it's not real, it's not It's not real. She's trying to get some money for it, from him. How huh, y'all know? How the hell do y'all know that this story is fake? It might be true. Her damn, the, his lawyer, his damn, his motherfucking lawyer snuck up there and said, we're going to fire, it's, we don't accept this accusation towards him, this false story that she comes up with. You don't know what this kid did behind the scenes. His lawyer, his manager, Selena Gomez is, is not around him 24 fucking 7. His mother's not around him 24 fucking 7. Y'all don't know that he fucked. Look, it's, he could have fucked that girl. He could have fucked that girl two years ago or a year ago. She said the girl, uh, Mariah Yeast. The Easter, I'm sorry if I didn't pronounce her last name right, but says that he was 16 at the time, she was 19 at the time, that she had sex with him on a tour, when he was doing a tour, because she brought him up, on, she, he told one of the bodyguards or bouncers to get this girl, they went backstage and they fucked. Now y'all know you can't make this shit up because you know every every single rapper that go even comedians that go on tour they're not gonna have their loved ones with them because they're going on tour just to make some money. He might have fucked this girl. Y'all never know. Y'all never motherfucking know because y'all are so so damn caught up on. Bieber fever bullshit. Oh, he's with Selena. I don't give a damn if he was with Mariah Carey. Damn it, when these damn singers, rappers go on the road, they're going to get some ass and dick from somebody. Now, you get all these damn female singers in up there, they're going to get some ding -ling. You got all these male singers and rappers, they're going to get some coochie. Now, y'all need to stop sitting up there defending this mother little motherfucker because he, he was 16 at the time. 16 at the time. That means his damn hormones are jumping like a motherfucker. That means he's gonna get some coochie. Now y'all need to stop sitting up there thinking that's not his child. And everybody knows when you're in a teen, when you're a teenager, you're gonna want to fuck. You're gonna wanna have sex with somebody. Cause you're you can't control your hormones in a teenage teenage age. Cause I, I know I, I, when I was in my teens, I wanted to fuck. Y'all just, y'all just cannot sit there and have the thought, oh, he's so innocent, he's so precious. The damn bitch from, not bitch, but the damn woman from C, uh, what is it, CSI, the, the original CSI show, she even told it on fucking TV. Oh, he's a brat. And y'all sitting up there saying, oh, it's not, it's, it's, it's impossible for him to have a baby. No, it's not. It is not possible. It is possible that he can have a child. It's not impossible. That's what y'all need to stop doing. Saying, oh, it's not impossible. Bull fucking shit, man. If it was not possible that a damn teenage boy couldn't fuck no girl that was 19, y'all need to start watching te uh, teenage, my teenage, uh, teen, my teen, uh, what's this show called, teen pregnancy, my teen mom, look at all them teenagers that had sex and got babies on them two shows, all them teens that was on them, them, them two shows had sex and got kids, now y'all don't want to sit there and believe that this boy ain't got no child. Y'all need to quit bullshitting. Let me tell you, there was one person, I actually seen this, and I'm going to show you what she said. 
I'm going to tell you what she said because I got to go look at the page. She says, this woman says, just do the DNA. Why keep talking about it? Make, make her look stupid and sue her. I agree with the first part. Just do the DNA. Why keep talking about it? I shit you not. I'm going to show it. I'm going to show where it says that. I'm not going to bullshit. And be, look, I'll show you. Just do the DNA. Why I keep talking about it? Make her look stupid and sue her. See, I ain't bullshitting. I said take... And, 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 and there's people who are going to say take the test. Yeah, take the motherfucking test. Quit playing around. That's all it is. Let me tell you something. Y'all remember that was a few years ago. Bill Cosby had this woman and her mother walk up on him when he was at a press conference or something like that. And this girl said, no, she went up to him and said, uh, Afro, uh, not Afro, he said, this girl went up to Bill Cosby and said, you're my daddy. You're my father. The first thing he said was, let's take a DNA test. And that bitch backed down like a heartbeat. She backed down like a heartbeat because she knew if she would have took that DNA test, she wouldn't have been fucked. You didn't see this damn Mariah girl backing down from a pregnancy test. But you damn sure got his damn lawyers and manager. You damn sure got Justin Bieber's lawyers and managers and family saying, uh, saying, oh, that's not his, that's not his. They're showing that he's guilty when you got motherfuckers speaking for him and he's tweeting this shit on Twitter. He might be the father of this this damn baby. If he is, he's going to come up out some fucking papers. He's going to come out of three months of fucking back pay. And he's going to have to pay child support. Pay child support till this child is 18. Y'all need to quit fucking around with this is it possible bullshit or impossible bullshit. Because it might. You never know. You never know. Back then, y'all was already backing up a lot of motherfucking celebrities. Oh, he didn't do it. She did it. Pulled in the finger. You blame OJ for a lot of shit. Oh, he killed that girl. We don't need to be going through that shit again. It's a, yes, it might be. Don't sit there, oh, it's impossible that he's the father of this child. No, no, don't get that shit put in your motherfucking head. Get that a maybe. You better have that fucking maybe in your motherfucking mind that he might be. Be the fucking father of this child. If he is, Selena, you pack your shit and go. Because he fucked around on you, girl. That's a lot of people say, oh, she's a child molester. Look, she was 19, he was 16. Big ass different. She was, that was legal. That was legal. That means there's no child paraphernalia right there. No child pedophile right there. 16, 17, 18, what? 19, four years apart or three years apart or something like that. Three or four years apart. And y'all so really ready to call her a child molester. She was still in her teens. And now, since this came to light, y'all ready to say, Oh, that's not his baby. Bull fucking shit. Just because he's got money in his fucking pocket doesn't make him any better than the next motherfucking line. If he can lay down with some girl and fuck her, he can take care of his responsibility. That means this motherfucker gonna have to settle his ass down and be a fucking father. If not, he's gonna be up that child support. And if it's a fucking scam for this girl to pull, if this is a scam for this girl to get money out of him, you're just stupid as shit to pull this. Why even do it? If you're gonna pull a good scam like that, you better have everything. You better, if if you're gonna get some money out of somebody like that, oh, you better make sure that damn child is his or hers or whatever. Don't play this damn, oh, that's my baby daddy shit. No, for real, y'all need to quit because it getting, it's getting nobody nowhere. His lawyers need to stop saying, oh, it might, it's not his child. You don't know, motherfucker. You wasn't there with him while he was getting his dick sucked. You wasn't there when he was getting his damn, uh, 
getting his wetting his fucking whistle. You wasn't there, so y'all raised back without it. It's not his. You better put that maybe or that might in your motherfucking head. Because that maybe and that might separates from the bullshit. See right there? You see when you put that maybe or might, that maybe or might, that's putting that shit right on that fence. That means that person that means he's got a fifty fifty chance. He got that one fifty. Oh, it might be mine. He's got that other fifty. Say so it might not. It's a fifty fifty chance when you add maybe or might. Because is when you put a maybe or might, it separates from the bullshit. Don't sit there and break up in two teams. It's his. You got one side saying it's his. You got the other side saying it isn't his. You and then you got the rest of them saying it's a might. It's a maybe. You just don't know. So quit that Billy Jack bullshit and put that might and that maybe in your motherfucking head. Cause I ain't got time for no petty bullshit. If he fucked this girl and got her pregnant, it's time for him to grow the fuck up. It's time for him to be a fucking father. And all them little tours he's doing, he gonna have to cut that shit out. Oh, you might say, oh, he's just a baby. He's 17 years old, about to hit 18. That means he's almost, when he is that 18, look, it's like this. When you lay down with dogs, you're going to get up with fleas. When you lay down with a girl, you're going to get up with something that you don't want or need in your life. Unless that, you, unless that you are ready or prepared. He lay down, If he lay down with this girl, he, he got up and got a baby. So y'all motherfuckers better get that. He's not or he is out your fucking minds. And better put that maybe or might in your motherfucking head. Because this is bullshit how all these people are trying to say that's not his child. You don't know. You wasn't there. Don't take up for this man. Don't take. He's not a man. He's a boy. Don't take up for this boy. That's wrong with y'all. Y'all get so fucking caught up in this bullshit. Ain't no, ain't no, no man. Yes, he is. Y'all was ready to sit there and jump on Miley Cyrus about petty little things. It's time to do the exact same thing what you did to Miley to Bieber. It's time for that shit. He is the new Miley. And it's time for his ass to get Molly walked. Because this is Billy Jack bullshit. Y'all playing these games. This, be, if, this has been Afro Joe. If you don't like what I got to say, kiss my ass and go somewhere because I don't need your bullshit. If you got something to say about this, about this issue, you better have something to say about this issue. If not, I'll delete it. If you like what I say, give me a comment, a video response, and share this around. Follow me on Twitter at, at Afro Joe the Wookie. Peace in the body of grease.